hello everybody today i like to discuss about javascript loop javascript loop means the block of code executes number of times until the given condition is false this is the co concepts of loop and this concept is implemented by <coughs> using uh, while loop for loop do while loop for in loop etc in javascript today i like to discuss about your while loop so i like to describe it with an example so let's first write down the script tag and then language we use here is <coughs> javascript great this is the starting of a script and this is the end of a script right the syntax of while loop is first we will have to say from where the looping will start okay suppose this is the variable i and we initialize this value as one right that means the loop will start from one okay now question is how long the loop will be executed until this condition is false means until the value of i is less than equal to i okay now this is the starting of while loop and this is the end of while loop what we like to do here simply we like to display whatever inside i right after displaying i we will have to increment we will have to increment i means after displaying i i will be incremented means the value of i will become 2 and uh, then again it will check the condition and still the condition is true because and if now i is 2 and 2 is less than equal to 5 again 2 will be displayed i incremented i will be incremented means 2 will become 3 and again the condition is true so a 3 will be displayed and here again i, I is incremented 1 so 3 will become to 4 till yet the condition is true so this 4 will be displayed and after that uh, i again incremented means 4 will become 5 till yet the condition is true because 5 is equal to 5 so this 5 will be displayed but after that when i is incremented that time 5 will become 6 at that time this condition will become false so the loop will terminate basically this is the concept so if we go to output okay so let us save it mm, look we are getting one two three four five okay in this way uh, in this way this loop is executed i can be incremented and i also can be decremented how look here <coughs> if we if we initialize the value of i like this this is fine that means the value of i is fine and this loop will be executed until the value of i becomes uh, zero means until the value is less than or equal to zero uh, until that the loop will be executed right this is the beginning of while loop and this is the end now what we'll do we will display the value of i and after displaying the value of i we will decrement it decrement this minus minus that means it will decrement one that means five will become four and till it the condition is true so again this loop will be terminated because 4 is less than equal to 0 this is this condition is true so
so again and I have to display 4 again i is decremented means 4 will become 3 till here the condition is true 3 is less than or equal to 0 condition is true so 3 will be displayed again i is decremented means 3 will become 2 but till here the condition is true because 2 is less than or equal to 0 so this 2 will be displayed again i is decremented means this time 2 will become 1 but till now the condition is true because 1 is less than or equal to 0 again this 1 will be displayed after that again i is decremented means 1 will become 0 but till now the condition is true because 0 is equal to 0 so 0 will be displayed here but after that 0 will become minus 1 because i is decremented 1 but now this condition becomes false because minus 1 is less than 0 right so that's why the loop will be terminated now because the condition becomes false so let us see the output I comment the first version and uh, then let us save it and uh, I go to the output look oh there is something wrong so yes uh, this will be here we give greater than to not be greater than it will be less than equal to zero okay now let us check the output now we are getting 5, 5 will be decremented 1, so it will become 4, then again 4 will be decremented 1, so it will become 3, 3 will be decremented 1, so it will become 2, 2 will be decremented 1, so it will become 1, and 1 will be decremented 1, so it will become 0, after that the condition will become false, so the loop will be terminated and we will get nothing now. So this is the basic of while loop and uh, we will discuss more about this while loop in our next coming class. So for today, after this, in my next